Raft idea video, Catch a Falling Ring. This activity is called Catch a Falling Ring and it's one of our raft idea sheets. It uses one yard of beaded chain and a two inch binder ring. I hold the beaded chain as, as shown here, slide the ring up the chain, and release. The way that this trick works is I'm going to hold the chain in one, one hand as though I'm making a C with my index and thumb. I'm going to let my, my C be parallel to the floor. With the ring, what I'm going to do is slide it up, holding it also in a C made with my index and thumb. And the next part is the crucial piece. My thumbs are positioned at an X. In other words, they are 90 degrees from each other. So that the falling end of the ring is going to fall into the open hole of the chain. The next crucial step is the release. What I'm going to do is move this index finger away from the ring and out of the picture without moving my thumb, which is also supporting the ring. So I'll count to three and you'll see this motion. One, two, three. Go ahead. Three. All right, so I'm gonna show you this trick really quickly. It's called Catch a Falling Ring. I'm just going to show you the motion of the ring. Yeah. Oh. Right. Amazing. Yeah, that was pretty good. Two C's with your hands. This is one. Take the digits out. These ones don't get to play. So just stay out. Raise the uh, chain up. Take the digits out. Take Now, when you're ready to drop the ring, the way that you drop it, without moving anything else, move this in the center away from the ring, because it's going to be later. But you can't move anything else. Okay. Whenever you're ready. Just all I have to do is move my index finger. That's a good thought. Oh, I did? <laughs> okay. Okay, so let's go back up. Index finger moves, the thumb does not. Oh. I don't even know how I did that. <laughs> That's pretty cool. You want to see how it works? Mm -hmm. When you release one finger, one side of the ring is free to fall. Okay. Okay. But the other side of the ring is hitching a ride on your thumb. Okay. When you made the X in your thumbs, what you've done is you've made sure that the falling side is going to head towards the open okay. hole in the chain, uh -huh. forming a large head knot. Got it. Good. <laughs> and that's how it's done.